throughout the cytoplasm you can see that there is a very complex labyrinth contained by a membrane and you can see that it over here you can see it here and here and throughout the cytoplasm this would represent the endoplasmic reticulum what you have here is you have an internal compartment within the cytoplasm and this compartment is interconnected as you can see here on the membrane we can see ribosomes this endoplasmic reticulum because you have ribosomes on the surface of the membrane would be referred to as rough endoplasmic reticulum or RER. This endoplasmic reticulum does not have ribosomes on the surface of the membrane. This would be referred to as smooth endoplasmic reticulum, SER. This is the Golgi apparatus, also known as the Golgi complex. You have compartments within the membranes in each of these flattened sacs and material can be transported from one to the next by way of transport vesicles. These vesicles right over here are secretory vesicles. They go towards the surface of the cell, fuse with the cell membrane, and release contents to the exterior of the cell. The mitochondria are represented here by these orange colored structures. Let's take a closer look at one of them that has been opened up. Here we can see one of these mitochondrion. A single mitochondrion is referred to as a mitochondrion. More than one are mitochondria. This is another organelle that has two membranes. And you can see that right over here, part of the mitochondrion has been cut open so that you can see some of the internal structure. You can see the internal membrane. The internal membrane has a greater surface area. And that's why you can see that it is folded. You see how it's folded right over here, and these folds are referred to as Christi. So the mitochondrion has this very distinct structure. The mitochondrion is the powerhouse of the cell. In a cell, 95% of the ATP would be produced in the mitochondrion. This is simply a vesicle, a membrane-enclosed spherical space the lysosome. Lysosome contains hydrolytic enzymes which are used by the cell to break down old organelles for recycling purposes, also for breaking down anything that has been brought into the cell by phagocytosis like bacteria. So in this model, the yellow structure represents the lysosome.